Here's a little VS Code trick you might not be aware of. You can actually use the command palette to install new extensions. To get started, I'm going to open up the command palette here and type ext and then space. When I do this, you can see that the command palette is now prompting me to press enter to manage my extensions. So the ext command in the command palette lets you run some additional commands for managing extensions. At this point, I'm just going to press enter to show that it opens up VS Code's normal extension view over here. So not too exciting. Let's go back and then say ext install and then space. At this point, now VS Code is prompting me for an extension name. So I can actually use the ext install command to install extensions. Let's say I don't know um, exactly what I'm looking for, but I want the git lens extension. So I could say git lens here. And you can see that it's prompting me to search for the git lens extension in the marketplace. And if I press enter at this point, it, as you would expect, opens up a search and has the git lens extension here at the top. But again, that's just open up, uh, opening up VS Code's normal extension view and pasting in the text git lens. So maybe not too exciting as well, because you can just click on this view down here and type out git lens. Let's go back here and say ext install one more time. And let's say that I now have the unique ID for this extension. And I'm just going to paste that in here. So this is the git lens extension ID, the publisher name, and then the extension ID. And now VS Code is actually prompting me to install the git lens extension when I press Enter. So I'm going to do that now. And you can see that now, just instead of showing the search results, VS Code has actually gone and installed this extension. So now git lens is properly installed here. So ext install is something that you might find listed on, the, for example, in a GitHub repository. And it's a quick way to allow uh, other people to install your extension as well. So if you have a readme for an extension on, on, um, that's hosted on GitHub, for example, you can tell users they can just paste ext install and then your extension ID in the uh, command palette here in VS Code. And they can automatically install the correct extension um, just using the command palette here. So that's kind of a, a neat trick that I think many people are probably not aware of you, that you can use the command palette in this, this way.